All right, we're alive. We're alive. Twelve people. All right, we're back at it again, doing fitness things. You guys are probably bored, but you're probably not, because that's what you're here for. Uh, all right, today we're going to do, uh, what are we doing? Three rounds, 10 deadlifts at 225, 500 meter row, 20 wall balls with a 20 pound ball to a 10 foot target. Uh, we're here at the Black and Brave. It's shut down for the evening, nobody's here. Um, this workout is not really going to be a sprint. You might be able to sprint through the deadlifts, but you're going to have to relax a little bit on the row a little bit. Wall balls are going to be what they're going to be, so we'll see how it goes. Having the row sandwiched in between is really going to frustrate me. Um, I do think sub, sub 10 minutes is definitely an option for sure. You're looking at, let's just say two minutes for the row, less than a minute. Eh. Sub 10 will be difficult. It will be very difficult, but we'll see. I think Travis can do it. Travis is over here. He's going to do it too. There he is. He's really fast at deadlifts and very efficient at wall balls. He rows fine, fine normal pace. <laughs> so uh, we're going to get started here in a little bit. I'm going to turn some music on. And for Joshy G, I'm not going to reset the clock. We're just going to start at an arbitrary number. Uh, this workout is brought to you by Dead Boys Fitness and by Whoop. I got a whoop now. Get a whoop. Track your data. I had a good recovery last night, so we'll see what happens. All right. Let me set up so you guys can see what we're doing. Hopefully nothing dies and you guys get to watch this whole thing. You never know with these, these deals. All right. I'm going to turn it around. I'm going to get some... Uh, music going so hold on one second while I do that all right I'm gonna set it up and we're gonna get going we'll probably start in uh, a minute and a half
Well. No humidity in this building. So if you like cotton mouth, black and brief, it's your place to train. Oh, uh, 949 for me. Travis sub nine, eight, eight, where'd you get? Huh, 65? 853, so sub nine for Trav, which is really fast. Really fast. Uh, no, that was not the warm up, that was the workout. Yeah, if you like your legs, don't do that one and your low back. It's gnarly on, on all that posterior chain. Even just staying upright in those wall balls. Your posterior chain so wrecked from the row and the deadlift that if you uh, if you let that wall ball carry you forward, it's gonna pull on your lumbar and your thoracic and it's gonna really make it difficult to breathe even though it's already difficult enough. Uh, good times, I guess, right? Hey. So the man you saw walking in here earlier is the owner and operator of 392 Cafe. Some of you may have seen me posting uh, online about 392 Davenport, and he wanted to drop off. No, there we go. How about that, huh? Business cards. That means we're official. Black on black, because you know. And then that's me. Get a hold of me if you have questions about coffee. Uh, that's opening up next door to the Black and Brave Wrestling Academy in downtown Davenport. Uh, probably sometime in January, so. We're going to have the best coffee in the entire Midwest right next door and one of the coolest uh, places to hang out, so I'm pretty stoked about that. Ugh. Why don't you stick to bodybuilding? If we do a little bit of uh, bodybuilding in here, but, uh, you know, the way the ring, the, the speed of the game today, you got to keep up, and so cardiovascular conditioning is just as important as is being mobile as is being agile and accurate, getting proper depth on your squats, pull-ups, presses, all those things. So bodybuilding is great for aesthetics, but not necessarily for performance. That's why. Workouts usually take between an hour and two hours, depending. I am not a co-owner. Uh, I guess I am. I'm mostly an investor, but uh, I'm not going to be involved in like the day-to-day -day operations. Jay and Jenna Sanders, owners of 392, they got that down. Any other questions? Travis is dead. CNS is gone. Yeah, CNS is gone. Anybody got anything? Jacob Boykin, just rehab, dog. Do what your um, therapists tell you to do and do it hard. Um, that's it, dude, just rehab, you gotta do it. That's all I did for five and a half months before I came back and even after that. Yes, Joshy G, Travis, he is the worst. Yes, we all hate Travis, Joshy G. Uh, Taylor Swift's all right. She got some catchy tunes. My advice for um, beginners in CrossFit, Aenaya, whatever your name is, uh, is to uh, just get into the gym. A lot of people just have a hard time getting themselves to the gym because they're afraid uh, they're going to get judged or um, that they're not going to be able to complete the workout. But every workout is scalable. For example. The workout we just did is essentially just deadlift, squats, and rowing. Now, anybody can get on a rower. I don't care how old you are or what your situation is. There's adaptations for the rower. And if you can't deadlift, 
you know, the prescribed weight, you can always take the weight down. You can take the reps down. You can take the rounds down. Uh, and if you can't throw a 20 pound wall ball, maybe you can throw a 14 or maybe you can't throw one at all, or maybe you can't even squat, you know? So if you can't even do an air squat without a ball, maybe you can just do a partial squat and throw a ball up against the wall. There's, it's infinitely scalable. It's the beauty of CrossFit. So, um, don't be scared to get into a gym and just, you know, give it a shot, put yourself out there. You won't regret it. I don't have a favorite band. I like too much music. Roman's doing well. Post Malone is awful and Drake is also awful. I do listen to some pop music, yes. No, I'm done getting tattoos, probably. Never say never, but probably. Uh, the Bears could win the Super Bowl. They got a shot. That defense is a Super Bowl defense. It's just a matter of, um, you know, how they played during the playoffs and if the offense can keep up. Michael Jackson's great. Oh, heck, you guys asked some bad questions. Huh. Sasha and Bailey are at their homes because we're off on a Christmas break for five days. So I got Travis instead. I don't have any free time. Ideal partner for mixed match? Probably Becky Lynch. Maybe Bailey. But Bailey's already had like 800 partners. I do like Nikki Bella. She's lovely. I hate Dakota Kai a lot. Like, I really hate her. Mostly because she embarrassed me in League of Legends. And I'm insecure, and so I just take it out on her. That's kind of my thing. I have wrestled Mustafa Ali. <gasps> I dare you to try to find it. Hardest thing about owning my own wrestling school is making sure the kids clean up after themselves. Brrr. All right, I'm over it. Thanks for the time, guys. Thanks for the workout. If you feel like working out, get in, try this one out. Honestly, a sub nine time is pretty impressive. Uh, once Travis got real hot in that first round, I didn't know if he was going to be able to keep the pace, but he did pretty good. Uh, sub 10 is, is solid as well. Um, I would say anywhere between like 10 and 15 minutes is probably an ideal time for this workout. Um, you know, four minutes a round is not bad. So um, 12 minutes is, is good for novices. If you want to push, you can try to get 11, sub 10. But um, I would, my advice would be to keep either the set small if the weight's pretty heavy for you or pick a weight that you can do the sets unbroken uh, so that you can move from implement to implement without taking too much of a break. You know, uh, really the only part that was super slow transition wise was just the first like 50 to 100 meters on the rower, just getting in and kind of getting started to get, get into your, your pole. For reference, I was pulling at like a 145-ish pace. Probably the first round, first 500, it was like 140 or 140, one minute, 40 second pace. And then well, about 145 the rest of the, the other two rounds. But just that, that first little bit getting into the rower just takes a second. And your hammies are a little tired from the uh, deadlifts. Everything else, not too bad. Enjoy, have a Merry Christmas um, or whatever you celebrate or if you don't celebrate at all. So uh, until next time, see you guys. Look out for Dead, Bo Dead Boys online programming coming 2019. Peace out.